So today, we are talking about the tool. Hold on, let me shut the door real quick. Door shut, we're good to go. Today we're talking about the CyberTool 42. You may have clicked on this video looking for a review, and I'm gonna give you a little bit of that kind of content. Or if you're one of my viewers, you know that I make music, so I have something cool for you. If you're new and you might be wondering, why the heck did I just do that? I'm a music guy, that's my thing. I'm also interested in EDC and knives and other stuff, but I love music. Uh, if you like music, maybe you liked that, please subscribe, plug in myself. Too early in the video, sorry about that. Today we're talking about the tool. Look at that. It's hooked to my belt, and then it goes into my pocket there. There she is, new member of my EDC team. First things first, let's go over the tools. Small knife, big knife, file, two-sided, saw, nail cleaner, scissors, pliers, screwdriver with bit jack. One of the bits is Phillips and flathead. Then inside of the tool, there's another bit carrier set thing. Tinier Phillips screwdrivers, small Torx, and most popular Allen, and then bigger Torx bits. Can opener and flathead. Bottle cap opener and bigger flathead. Cork screw. Inside the cork screw, there's a little tiny, let me see here, a little tiny screwdriver. Can you see that? These are the hardest tools to get out. I have a chisel, a smaller flathead screwdriver, what is attributed as the most useless tool, which is the hook. And then, ah, the awl. Owl? It's for punching holes in leather and you can drill holes in wood. It has the hole so you can sew with it. Now, this device is a new EDC item for me. And the main reason I'm making this video is to share with you the method that I carry. I kind of already showed you. Let me go over it again. So the first thing you need to do is go ahead and purchase this. It's a belt clip with like a clasp thing on it. This particular one is made by Victorinox. And like always, you guys, I'll go ahead and link that down below. The key is that all Victorinox tools and knives come with this little key ring. So simply go ahead, let me zoom in here, take it, slide it onto the keychain, and it dangles there. And then you slip it into your back pocket, just like that, move that over, and you're good to go. There is one question though, and that's does it pass the chair test? Check. 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 Hmm. Can't even feel it. Check. Gosh dang it. Works in that situation too. Check. So the conclusion is that it's great even for sitting. You can just throw it in your back pocket. That's really the misconception that I wanted to address in this video because I see on all these forums, people go, well, three layers. If it's past three layers, it's too big for a pocket knife. It's a good pouch knife. It's a good kit knife. It's a good knife for your bug out bag. If you're motivated, nay, if you're just capable of turning on your noggin, you can come up with a way to carry a big sack. By the way, for those of you who don't know, sack, S-A-K is Swiss Army knife, sack. And so those are my thoughts. I don't know how well this knife performs based on just today playing with it. I got it today. It was a Christmas present. What can I say? I got it. Based on my initial inclinations, I like it so far. 
but we'll have to see. I, I need to put it through use. I can't just review something, especially a knife, something I'm not really an expert on. I can't just give an opinion right off the bat. We'll see how practical it is, and I'll definitely update you guys in the future. And as I was saying earlier, consider subscribing. But please don't subscribe expecting a bunch of videos about Swiss Army knives or knives in general. Usually I make content about music. I do short films and stuff like that. But if that sounds interesting to you, you might enjoy my content, so consider it maybe. Now, if you're a Swiss Army knife fan, let me know by hitting the like button. And if you prefer other multi-tools, tell me down below in the comments. Don't hit the dislike button. I know there's a ton of Leatherman fans and Gerber fans out there. I personally am as well. But tell me down in the comments, what multi-tool or what knife, what's your EDC blade that you carry? I'm the Music Vlogger. Thanks for watching. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace.